Hi everyone, this is Gina from Designs for Screen. In my last video, I showed you how to customize a family reunion Corel Draw template for um, custom t-shirts for your next family reunion. And I've had a couple people ask me how they can use this design in my online t-shirt creator to make uh, either to print t-shirts one at a time or to create giveaway items, prizes, um, such as you know, mugs, hats, aprons, uh, tote bags, things like that using the uh, custom design. So I'm gonna take a minute and show you how to do that real quick. Once you have your design created uh, with your updated name and your any other changes you wanted to make to the, to the design, what you'll need to do is create a PNG file that you can then upload into the creator. So the way that you do that is you take your Corel Draw design and you'll need to delete the background color. So you'll simply click on that red box and hit your delete key. And you'll see if you go up under view wireframe, the rest of the design is still there. It's just that the parts that are in white are not showing up. So that's why it looks a little like we lost some parts of the design there, but they are still there. So what you're gonna do next is hit file and then go down to export for web. And you'll wanna make sure that the transparency block is checked. That way um, your design parts where there are, is no color will be transparent so that whatever color item you decide to put the design onto will show through. And click Save As, and you'll wanna save it on your computer, name it whatever you want, um, and you wanna make sure that the file type save as PNG, and then hit Save. I've already saved it once, so that's why it's asking me if I wanna replace it. So now you have a PNG file saved on your computer. So if you go back to um, my Designs for Screen website, click on Create a T-shirt now, that'll take you to the Creator page. And then if you click on Upload, click that little box saying, yes, I have permission to use this design, and upload an image, and simply go to your file on your computer, click the PNG file, and open, it will upload that. Click on it, hit select, and there you've got your design. You can resize and put it on a t-shirt here. You've got your t-shirts, put it on any, any color. See why that's, that's why we use the transparent background so that no matter what uh, color t-shirt you choose. Now it's going to look better on some colors than others just because we've got the black and white, but um, you can pick different color t-shirts to print on depending on what you want. Now if you want to create some prizes or giveaways or little memorabilia uh, to give away at the, at the reunion, just click on accessories and you'll see uh, different items will come up. Mugs, um, hats, tote bags, different things. So let's say we chose, um, let's see, what color does this mug come in? We won't be able to use the white background because the design has white in it so it wouldn't show up. Um, so we need to find a mug that is available in different colors. There should be one somewhere. Let's try this one. Select, yes. Now this one is available for printing all around the mug, not just on either side. Um, but you can move it over here if you just want it to be printed on the 
one side of the mug or if you want it to be centered around the front, whatever you prefer. Just resize it until you like how it looks. And that's what it would look like on one of the mugs. If you want to change it to blue, see how that would look. Of course, it's not going to look around black probably because they've got the, the darker lettering in there. Uh, let's see. Oops. I'm going to put it on an apron. You could do that if you're having a family reading a cookout or something like that. That might be appropriate for it. For an apron design. Of course, there's different colors available for that as well. So that could be a cool idea for a family reunion. Um, let's see what else? Bags, tote bags. This pads only come in white, so that's not going to work out so well. Travel mugs, you could use the uh, silver version. The design would show up on the silver version. Now, of course, if you know how to use Corel Draw and can go in and change the colors, um, instead of just using the black and white, you can always change it to a different color that would show up on the white. Um, maybe I'll show you how to do that in a different video. But uh, if you know how to do that, certainly you can change the colors, create a different PNG file, and upload to be able to put it on other colored items as well. But um, that just gives you an idea, some different things that you can do. Um, you can make your dog a bandana with the design on it. Now, if you've got little ones in the family too, you could even uh, do some, some onesies or some kid shirts. Um, kid shirts, and there's even some little dresses for uh, if you've got any little girls in the family. That's really big. Need to shrink that down. But you could make some cute. Uh, little dresses for the girls, little girls in the family, if you want to do that instead of a t-shirt or even just to give away as a prize. Bibs, those would be cute for maybe a baby's first family reunion. Do a couple bibs for new babies in the family, things like that. So there's a lot of different possibilities and things that you can do uh, with the creator online. So hope this gives you some great ideas. And um, if you make something cool, I'd love to see what you're doing. Feel free to send me some pictures and I'll post them on my website. Thanks. Till next time. Enjoy.